In this exercise, we're going to enable one-click action for the service request approval task. The one-click action feature for tasks enables end users to complete a task by clicking a link in the task's notification email. You can configure several actions that appear as links in the one-click action email. For each action, you can set the task's form fields to specific values. When the end user clicks a link, the task's form fields automatically populate with these values, thereby completing the task. In App Studio, click the Service Request Approval task, then in the Properties panel, make sure the one-click action checkbox is selected and click the Ellipsis button. Be aware that when you enable the one-click feature, you might cause a security breach. Make sure this feature complies with your organization's standards. Select a link expiration, which by default is 30 days. After the specified time, the link will no longer be active and end users will not be able to approve the task with the one-click feature. Click the Add New Action button and enter a meaningful action name and description. Then click Add Assignment. From the To drop-down menu, select Default View Approve, and in the Value text box, type True. The task is now enabled for one-click action, and message recipients will be able to quickly approve the task directly from the message. As always, click Validate to make sure the feature you implemented is working correctly. Be sure to visit our Core Sequence Knowledge Center and our growing community.